Okay, we're here with Buckshot. Uh, what can you tell us about the upcoming season? The upcoming season, it should be a good season, knowing that we got a lot of people that came in, transferred in, knowing that last year's season was only the build up for this season, coming, coming along as my senior year. We still have a lot of seniors on the team, and this year should be a pretty good year. What's your approach to quarterbacking a team? What, what, what are the, what's the most important thing for you to do as the quarterback and the leader? I think I just always have to keep my composure at all times. Uh, be a leader on and off the field, keep my guys on, up to date with all the information I know, and just, when if we're down, just bring them back up, and let them know that we're still in the game if we're down or anything. Now, when you're looking downfield, what, what are some of the guys that you know if you get the ball there? Uh, definitely Montre Smith, outside receiver. Speed, speed, fast, catch everything. Also, Steven Nubo, quick, explosive guy. Montre, I mean, keep on dingle. Just put the ball anywhere, he's gonna go and get it. And fit the tuck with great, runs great routes. And definitely put the ball anywhere again, he's gonna come down with it. Now, uh, you, you've been with Kara City for a while. You were in another program before. Mm -hmm. But how can you say since you tra transferred to Carroll City and under Coach Aubrey Hill and some of the coaches there, how has that helped you? It helped me a lot knowing that Coach Aubrey Hill, he definitely, when I came in, he took me under, under his wing, guided me through it. just even going to school. He taught me pretty much how to cool myself, how to keep my composure at all times. And he just is a great coach. Love to be with him. He taught me a lot through the whole experience. Now, as far as uh, one of the things a lot of people notice about you is your quick release. Mm -hmm. How can you? How how would you say what you've learned under strong arm? And, you know, you guys won some championships with one pylon not that long ago. Uh, how do, how does that translate to the high school game? I mean, just knowing that if he comes out to break real quick, just putting the ball right there on him. Or even if I got to wait one second and put in the second window, I got the arm strength and the power to get it there. My quick release is, is going to get it there. All right. And, uh, and finally, uh, what do you foresee for Carroll City? Uh, Carroll City has been a strong program in the years past. We're seeing that coming up on the coach on the coach hill. Can you say this this year you guys gonna you gonna make a run? And yeah, why we, so? We definitely have a good chance. Uh, what what I should say is last year we we were a new program pretty much. Everybody came together as one, and this year it should everybody should come along as one team and, and finish for the uh, state champ. But we got to take it one game at a time and forced to make the playoffs and then take it from there. Uh, my name is David Hood. My last name is spelled H-O-O-D and I play for Miami Carroll City. What position? I play defensive tackle and defensive end. Okay. Now, uh, Carroll City's been a, a, a program that in the past has been strong. Mm -hmm. They had some championships. The defense was known. Uh, can you say that's that's the case again? Yeah, that's the case. But we back and we trying to put them back on the map and get everybody to college and get us this ring. Right. And, uh, how, how long? What, do you know what was the last time Carroll City got a ring? 2003. 2003. Yeah. That's a long time. That's a long time, but we bringing it back. We're bringing it back. Now, uh, Coach Hill and the coaches on, in, the, in the program mm -hmm. have been building the program up. Yes. How has that helped you personally and, and the whole team as a whole to, to be able to say you could do that? All right, to be able to say I could do that is because, like, before ACT, I wasn't even thinking about taking ACT. I wasn't even thinking about college at a point in time. Coach Hill came here, came to Carroll City and changed everything around. Got us offers, got us um, test scores out the way, everything just good now. So he building it up the chemistry and we work so much harder now and it's like we done came together and it just feel good. So it feel good to be a team. Yeah, it's a big program. Yeah. And we, we see it in the social media. Mm -hmm. You know, you guys are happy with that, promotion and all that. Now, uh, how do you back that up personally? What do you bring to the table as a D tackle when you're coming down? Do people got to watch out for you? Oh, they know they got to watch out for me because I'm going to get it started on the defense. I'm going to make the first noise. So y'all just be ready because I'm coming. I'm going to start it off. All right. And I'm going to finish. You're going to finish. So you guys got a good offense yeah. and a defense. Defense number that, one in D County right now. Well, that's a recipe for what? 
for Kansas City. No, for what? what? What did you say before? Good offense, good defense. Oh, for state champs. State champs. Yeah. Right. We, we look forward to that. I think, uh, we think you guys are going to do well. Mm -hmm. You guys got a good program. Uh, who, who could be those teams that you foresee in your division mm -hmm. that you got to look out for? You know, because, uh, you know, everything's good now. It's preseason. You know, you guys got the work ethic to do it. Yes. But there's going to be some battles. Who do you see? The, the team that I see might be the toughest is probably New Orleans and Miami Central. Exactly. And that's who, I, that's who I think will be the toughest. Anything else, we come. We're just going to play. Take it one game at a time. Cat Central's been dominating for a while. Yeah, they've been dominating. We've been coming up a little short. But it's time to change that. Yeah, you guys had some uh, some good games in the past. You played before the T2. Yeah, you played with the T. I know they're not in your division, mm -hmm. but they still, you know, somebody you still got to play up for. Yeah, we got to play up for. They still have a good team. I think they're going to do something again this year. They go, they always going to have a good team. Okay. Speed. Excellent. All right, so uh, any last messages you want to tell people? Uh, we back. We putting CC back on the map. We coming. That's the goal.